we're picking carrots and eating points. That's right, it's Point Salad from AEG. This Point Salad Point Salad pits two to six players in a veggie pulling fight to collect the most impressive trove from the market. The setup begins with a count of the cards. Point Salad contains 108 cards, 18 copies of six different vegetables on the veggie side, and a variety of point scoring options on the point side. Depending on the number of players, shuffle together a deck of cards. For two players, six of each veggie. For three players, nine of each veggie. For four players, 12 of each veggie. For five players, 15 of each veggie. For six players, use all dim cards. Remove any unused cards from the game without looking at them so you're unsure of the values on their point side. Shuffle the deck and create three roughly equal piles, point side up. Draw and flip two cards, veggie side up, from each pile and place them below their respective deck. This forms the veggie market. Randomly select a start player and you're ready to Caesar the day. Gameplay occurs in turns, during which the active player may draft cards from the center area in one of two ways. They may either draft one point card from one of the three point card piles, or draft up to two veggie cards from the market. After either selection, they add the card or cards to their personal tableau, after which their turn is complete. Additionally, as a free action once per turn, the active player may choose to flip over any one point card, either drafted this turn or previously, to its veggie side. You cannot flip a veggie to its point side. Once the turn is over, refill the veggie market if needed by flipping cards from the corresponding point deck. If a deck ever runs out, split the largest pile roughly in half to replace the empty deck. After the market is refilled, play passes to the left. The game ends when all cards from both the point card piles and the veggie market have been drafted. Players score up their points based on the values on their point cards. For example, in this scenario, our first condition is for every set of one onion, one tomato, and one pepper, we get eight points. We have two full sets, so that's 16 points. This second condition is for every set of three carrots, we get eight points, so that's another eight points. The next card says each onion, we get two points. For each pepper, we get two points. And for each cabbage, we get minus four points. So that would be four points for onions, eight points for peppers, and minus four for cabbage. And our final point condition is if we have an even number of peppers, we get seven points, and an odd number of peppers, we get three points. Looks like we get seven points. That leaves us with a total of 39 points. And the highest score wins. That's Point Salad. I'm Becca Scott, and let me leave you with a helpful tip. When you're ordering a salad, ask for your bonus points tossed. You can watch me and my friends play this game and other awesome games on Game the Game right here on Geek and Sundry. We'll see you there.